our chemistry teacher at the middle school. I remember he shoot one experiment in the class, and he used the sodium put in the water, and the water with the sodium reacted very fast, then followed by the explosion. That's really dragged me into the world and what's happening there. You know, what is the reaction or can we control it? I think that's really I get started to be interested in chemistry. My current research is working on asymmetric catalysis. So basically just uh, try to develop a technology method to access a chiral compound. We really contribute into a specific area we call catalytic asymmetric de-aromatization reaction. So for this type of reaction, uh, we want to convert commercially valuable and cheap material like a planar compound without a chirality, then we can convert them to a three-dimensional molecule with a chirality. Caro is actually the Greek word. It just means hand. So for a lot of organic compounds, and they just like our hands, the left hand and right hand, they are almost identical, but they are kind of superimposed each other. My research is for asymmetric catalysis. We want to enable the transformation, but you just get one of them, and you try to eliminate another one. This is highly privileged in the drug discovery program. So that's why currently we have a collaboration with a, a several international pharmaceutical company. As a professor working in academia, by reading the literature, we get some knowledge. But I think most importantly is uh, imagination. SLC is rather close to the river across Shanghai. So I run along the river. Sometimes I will stop in the middle. A lot of things can inspire you. Sometimes you think of something you, you couldn't get from the lab. The challenge is always, uh, um, always doing something new. But when you dig deeper, you don't have something to follow directly based on the literature. Everything is unknown. If you want to surprise uh, the community, you have to face something really much more challenging. Being chemist, organic chemist, you know, we can make things. We can really make something new, but uh, the challenge is always uh, to create something really benefit our society. Something I like my job is, you know, you're always doing something new. We publish, then we move to the next target. And it's also unknown, also new. It's always exciting. I've been the associate editor since 2014. It's been a great experience. I get the privilege to learn things before they get published. Another benefit for ACS model is most associate editor, including myself, we're scientists working in the same field. We know the field very well, so that helps us to, to make the best decision for the authors, for the community, and also for the journals. <laughs>